Hi, this is Rob from Intelligent Irrigation, and we're back at Dave's place today, and we're in the upper backyard where we're doing another installation from him, and Dave's got some really cool things going. He's got some homemade flower pots where he's going to grow some strawberries and some various vegetables in his backyard. So what he did, first of all, when I say homemade, is we got a bucket here that we take from Home Depot, and he cut the holes in it, as you see, because this is where he's going to plant everything. And everything's going to be growing out the side right here real big. And so to irrigate it, we got the AquaJet vertical device. And what we did is we locked it in the bucket with some tie wraps here. So it's locked into place. And as you see, from the inside, we got the holes down here. Holes on the bottom so the water drains out so nothing pulls up and it won't drown the roots. Got the holes where everything's going to be growing out of. You're going to put the soil in. And then... We got the aqua jet right here, which is going to water this whole bucket on two different levels and give it the aeration. And once again, we're going to water at four inches under. So all these are going to be in the root zone and the water is going to come out and fall down. And so we'll show you what the, uh, the other installation has got going because this is really neat um, D DIY project. And here we go. Let me show you what we got going here. So as you know, we got the aqua jet coming around here to the orange tree. Now it's going to come up and feed these. But what Dave did is he got these posts right here nice post with the brackets right here that he bolted on and then he sunk these in the ground so as you see as you come down he's going to have it all the way across his yard here all the way to the end or until we grow strawberries and tomatoes and that what happens when you put the soil in there everything will level out and it's going to sit there with the level coming up it's going to be watered all at one time with the aqua jet everything's going to be growing out of here once again got the post in Dave did it all himself, so it's a really cool project. And he's got some really good vegetables growing along here, along the wall, and of course with the grass. And it's been about, oh, about a month, maybe a month and a half since we've done the lawn here with the AquaJet. So you can see everything is going really good. It's got a really nice dark green color. Everything's growing really well. Now we're gonna have some vegetables up here with the AquaJet irrigation device. And then in the future, we're gonna have some raised beds right over there on top. So. This is Rob, we want to show you this. We'll come back when we have the soil in it and everything's growing and uh, let you see what it looks like. But we wanted to show you this really neat, really neat DIY project, once again, with the object, as you see, in the barrel. Really cool project. Okay, so we'll come back and show you what it looks like with the, everything watering and the vegetables growing in. So for now, this is Rob from Intelligent Irrigation, LLC, reminding you to water the intelligent way with the aqua jet.